there we go, I had to select the right fucking window. Also, yes, I'm sick of this fucking jingle now. <laughs> Alright, now that I've had it ingrained into my head. Uh, as noted on the, uh, on the little stream pasted there, shoot a papyrus. This is a rewarding rewarders request, uh, from the 2013-21X list. Brought to you by an anonymous user who requested that I play this and or the Age of Empires 2 campaign and split the 15 hours however I see fit. I play enough fucking strategy games, so let's go adventuring! Never played this game. I've, uh, seen Kakoskia play a little of it. And, uh, well, it's a thing. Let me take a look at my controls here. Keyboard and mouse. That, that seems legit to me. I won't be able to show the chat, but, uh... I guess I could, but nah, it'll be fine. Also, this music is really loud in my head. There we go, I'll turn it down for me and not for you guys so much. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and start... Between 1830 and 1870, nearly half a million Americans migrated. I didn't get started reading on that sooner. Well, that doesn't matter, folks. What matters is that, in order to go adventuring, we need some people to go adventuring with! Fucking Captain Walmart is going to be adventuring with us! The first party member was Captain Walmart! He was male, he was a fine gentleman, and he was... Uh, he was a black man with a mustache. The second party member... If the game will actually tab out, there we go was ostentatiousness Let me go ahead and select super wet us ten Can I just type? Oh thank god, yes. Ostentatious Ostentatious was a fair lady. She had long red hair. The third party member... <laughs> ...was... Hmm... Who was it? Was... Sadus21! <laughs> yeah! Fight me, Grim. <laughs> Third party member was Sadus twenty one. I can't do numbers. Sadus, he was a fine gentleman, and he was a good Aryan. All right, Captain Walmart, ostentatious, and Sadus, we're going adventuring. They traveled in their trusty wagon. A bunch of wagons I don't have because I've never played the game before. They set off into the forest. Okay, those are my default controls. Got it. Seeing some animals in upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on food for the long journey. Alright. Oh, goodness! I accidentally got a skunk! No! Give me your food! All of it! I need all of your hides! I'm great at the hunting game! A posse of bandits interrupted the hunt. So reading the chat will be a little bit difficult for me. <laughs> That's okay, because you guys will have plenty of fun. And no one really cares about you, really. Shit. This is too much action for me. Especially in a windowed mode. Machine gun armed bandit wagon arrive. Holy shit. I'm scared, everyone. They got a machine gun. In case you didn't know. Oh, I can just hold down the space bar. That's great. Hurt. Hurt. Ugh. 
Sadus tried to use the pistol as a shoehorn and accidentally bent the barrel. What the fuck? What the hell? Ostentatious looked for the left the wagon to look for wild berries. On her way back to the wagon, Ostentatious heard a noise in the tree. <laughs> a bear wanted the berries. Oh goodness. In its last dying breath, the bear let out a cry for help. The bear's extended family heard the call cry. Why is the barrel still bent? Why? Why? Why did you do this? I am never bringing you on a super amazing wagon adventure again. <laughs> God damn it, bear. They fixed the bend in the pistol, thank God. <laughs> they reached a river crossing. Ostentatious had the brilliant idea to try to jump over the river. Alternately, they could ford it. Well, all of my viewers tell me that I always have to ford rivers. They made the probably wise decision to ford the river. There were, these, there were boulders in the river. Of course there were. Hmm. There were a lot of boulders in the river. Alright. Because making those sounds totally helps me cross the river better. There was a pirate ship blocking their progress. Alright, of course there was. Because why not have pirate ships in life? Finally, they reached the other side of the river. They entered into the Great Plains. Captain Walmart came down with mumps. Uh-oh, Captain Walmart. And I can shoot the boulders in the river? Interesting. I'll keep that in mind. Alright, we got some buffalo here. Obviously, we can carry a lot more meat around in this game than we can in Super Amazing Wagon Adventure. And I have to be careful not to get hit, because Captain Walmart has been, uh, infected with mumps. <laughs> Buffalo times eight. Oh, goodness. Well, oh, I want that. But I wasted some health to get it. Not exactly the best trade you've ever made, girl. Alright. Hides are good. Captain Walmart lost a bit of health. We just got him. That's not so good. Done yet? Are we done yet? Some angry buffalo charge. Why are they angry? Is it because I killed? They never did this to the white people who rode on the back of trains trying to starve out the Native Americans. Damn it! This is bullshit. This is not historically accurate. <laughs> I demand recompensation. Oh, I can demand compensation. Well, Captain Walmart recovered. Everyone. That's good. They came across a fur trader. The fur trader offered to trade them newer, faster wagon wheels for 50... Sure! Oh. Oh my. There was a... <laughs> of course there was. Because why the fuck not? The wagon was picked up by the tornado. Naturally. Along with some buffalo. Oh dear god! <laughs> no! Too fast! Grimoth can't process that fast with a microphone in front of him. Oh god! I'm getting vertigo! Someone get me off this goddamn ride! The front wheels of the wagon fell off, the wagon was stuck. Well, at least we survived the tornado. Sadus left the wagon to fetch the wheels. The first wheel rolled a two! <laughs> The second wheel rolled near a coyote den. Um, send help! Send help! Help! Sadus returned to the wagon and put the wheels back in place. They reached another river. This one was too deep to ford. Shit! Ostentatious had the brilliant idea to swim underwater through the river. Alternatively, they could go around it through a desert path. Well, obviously we have to do... 
the completely, you know, logical option that would consume the most time and resources and go around. They made the proudly wise decision to take the desert path around the river. But how can you never ford a river? That's not what Oregon Trail taught me. They came across a gambling coyote. The cowboy bet them all their animal hides they couldn't kill 20 quails in 15 seconds. I agree with you. They refused the bet. They couldn't risk losing all their animal hides. They avoided venomous snakes. We did? I guess we did. I don't think we actually did. Hey, I actually got a weapon! Hey! How about that? I got another weapon. The man-eating giant scorpions are even more deadly. I like the concept of actually having weapons to use. This is, this is amazing. Amazing. It's like I'm not limited to just a pistol in this game. My god. Science. Damn it! No! Afraid of running out of water, they traveled faster. Oh, great. <laughs> Remember your training. Remember your training! Uh, no. Captain Walmart, you've got to hang on, goddammit, man! You unlock just desert survival mode. They noticed some supplies in the sand on the side of the trail. Sadus left the wagon to investigate. Sadus then realized why the supplies were left there. He was in a giant anthill of giant ants. Of course he was. Oh god, it's, it came from the desert! No! 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 I don't have any grenades to lob at them! Sadus ran back to the wagon. They entered a mountain pass now. Food supplies were dwindling, so they hunted. Alright. We're doing a good job hunting. Give me them fat loots. Damn it, we're out of bow. My precious bow. It is dead to me now. A pack of wolves smelled the blood. Wolves! I don't like this shit. That's rude. Wolves, why you be smelling blood? Why you tripping? Eat it, wolves. Eat it. Damn it, I didn't mean to grab that, but... Sweet. I keep unlocking shit. They came across a fur trader. The fur trader offered them supplies in exchange for animal hides. Yes? Hooray, Captain Walmart is better. Turns out a nearby mountain was an active volcano. Of course it was! <laughs> they rushed to avoid the approaching lava. Um, wolves burning alive right now from the water <laughs> I have more reaction time in Oregon Trail! This is bullshit. Von volcanic bombs rained down from above. This really is a super amazing wagon adventure. How could it not be? More wolves ran out for the lava? While well, it's raining the stones. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? This is not good fucking kidding me. <laughs> Distracted by the lava and wolves, they drove off the cliff. <laughs> Some eagles attacked the wagons. Oh god. Eagles! Fucking eagles! I'll make you extinct! Sadus admired the majestic evil, a symbol of our main nation, then the eagle killed him. Sadus! This is what you get for bending my pistol, motherfucker! Alright, ostentatious, you gotta survive! You gotta hold on! Luckily, the wagon landed at a river. The wagon now ref was carried down river by the currents. All right, Captain Walmart, lead us to victory with your mustache. Apparently I can shoot these, but if I don't have to... Well, I now have to. And Captain Walmart lost a point of health in the process. Oh, goodness. A boulder knocked Ostentatious out of the wagon and she drowned. Oops. 
Good news, everyone! Must have been silent seems because there's a bunch of bears in there. <laughs> of course they were bears! Of course bears take multiple hits! Bears take a lot of hits. Yes, they do. Captain Walmart noticed something in the horizon. It was a bandit on a raft. It seems the bandits had followed him and set up an ambush. Hmm. This isn't good, Captain Walmart. I don't think you got this. Captain Walmart died from blood loss after a bullet passed through his chest. Their journey ended there. The bandits looted the remains of the wagon and left the rest to sink. Game over. Well, holy shit, that was my first intense super amazing wagon adventure. Motherfucker. <laughs> ah. Let's go adventuring. Well, obviously, we can't have these people anymore. We need some more people. We need... We need Ice King! Ice King, you will save us! Ice King! Ice King was a fine gentleman who had sweet shades. The next person... Go ahead and press backspace a bunch of times here. Was dumb gold. Dumb gold was a fine gentleman who had a hipster mustache. The third party member. Was. Blah. <laughs> Blah was a fair lady who had long blonde hair. <laughs> they traveled in their trusty wagon. I think I unlocked a bunch of survival modes, but that doesn't change wagons, so they set off into the forest. Seeing some animals in an upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on food for the long journey. And apparently, extra medkits, which... Another medkit. But unfortunately, we can't save those for later. This is not organ trail here, people. Goddamn. A posse of bandits interrupted the hunt. They would, those little shits. Another medkit! Where were those when I needed them in the river, you bastards? Nuh huh? Uh, apparently, I have one of these. That's a thing. A machine gun armed bandit wagon arrived. No! Juke Grimoth! Use the hit stick! Make a sad fumble! God damn it, Grimoth. <laughs> There we go. Dumb Gold left the wagon to look for wild berries. At least the fucking pistol wasn't bent this time. That's good news. On his way back to the wagon, Dumb Gold noticed an entrance to a cave. He decided to investigate. Of course he did. It was very dark inside. Upon lighting a torch, he found it was filled with guns and ammunition. <laughs> well now, Dumb Gold! Dumb Gold returned to the wagon with the guns. He sat around the campfire and told dirty jokes. Yay! They reached a river crossing. Ice King had the brilliant idea to try to jump over the river. Alternatively, they could ford it. Well, my viewers tell me that I have to ford a river every single time. It's absolute proof. Every time I play a game that involves fording, and sometimes, even when I don't play a game that involves fording, they're like, You have to ford the river! It's the only way you can prove yourself to be a man, even though you're at the Green River that will undoubtedly kill you every time you try to ford it, Grimoth. You gotta ford it. True facts. <laughs> and so many of my viewers are screaming, Jump. 
Well, make up your fucking mind, you goddamn harlots. You're like, you need to ford the river, and now I need to jump the river. <laughs> Metal Slime Hunt says exactly, fuck who you think it jump. Mm hmm. <laughs> you can afford to jump. We're the chuckle fucks, we never make up our mind. They got a running start and leapt from the top of a ledge. We. They only made it halfway across the river and they landed in the middle of some rapids. Damn it. Apparently I blew up a rock by accident. Something, something, something boulders. Finally they reached the other side of the river. They entered into the Great Plains. I've still got 14 uses of bazooka. Dumb Gold came down with yellow fever. Good job, Dumb Gold. They came across a large herd of buffalo. I got what you need, buffalo! Yeah! This does not give me hides to collect at all. And I find myself, strangely, lacking care or concern. Hmm. Buffalo, 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 buffalo. No, the med kit was used on Dumb Gold. He didn't need it because he'd survive from his yellow fever and get healed later. You fool game. You're a damn fool. Damn it. We're getting it. <laughs> this is not my fault. I accept your own fault. Mm, there we go. The number of buffalo was absurd. What? Alright, let us slowly curve a path through these buffalo. Heading for the sacred medkit. Sanctity. Ah, there's another medkit up there, but I can't get to that one. Some angry buffalo charged the wagon. Of course they did! Wouldn't you be angry, too? Dumb Gold recovered from yellow fever. Absurb Buffalo, says Ashbringer108. Apparently I'm supposed to find the fur trader, Arabolt says. He can't wait. Also, I need some air conditioner, because this shit is too intense in my room right now. Air conditioner, let's go adventuring! They passed through a civil war battle. Well, here you go. Because this totally happened, right? <laughs> <laughs> 